वी आर जस्ट डिस्कसिंग अबाउट दस कार्बोकेटायन मग अपन कार्बोकेटायन मध्य आतापर्यत का स्टडी के लिए जस्ट इंट्रोडक्शन वी हैव स्टडीड व्हाट इज मीन बाय कार्बोकेटायन एंड सम प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ कार्बोकेटायन त्यानंतर सेकंड स्टेप मध्ये आपण बघितलं कार्बोकेटायन मध्ये स्ट्रक्चर मीन्स व्हॉट इज द हायब्रिडायझेशन ऑफ कार्बन व्हॉट इज द जॉमेट्री हाऊ द सिग्मा बॉन्ड्स आर फॉर्म त्यानंतर थर्ड स्टेप यामध्ये आहे जनरेशन वी हॅव स्टडीड हाऊ दॅट कार्बोकेटायन आर जनरेटेड फ्रॉम डिफरंट ऑर्गॅनिक कंपाउंड हाऊ दे आर जनरेटेड हे त्यामध्ये आपण पाहिलं अँड फोर्थ स्टेप मध्ये आपण पाहिलं स्टॅबिलिटी ऑफ कार्बोकेटायन व्हॉट इज द रूल ऑफ इंडक्टिव्ह इफेक्ट हायपर कॉन्जुगेशन इफेक्ट देन रेझोलन्स इफेक्ट अँड अरोमॅटिक नेचर ऑन द स्टॅबिलिटी ऑफ कार्बोकेटायन नाव लेट अस सी इम्पॉर्टंट पॉइंट रिएक्टिव्हिटी रिगार्डिंग दॅट कार्बोकेटायन मीन्स वी विल सी सम ऑफ द एक्झाम्पल्स ऑफ द केमिकल रिएक्शन वी विल सी हाऊ दॅट कार्बोकेटायन Uh, participate in the chemical reaction first one is the combination with nucleophile yes carbocation having positive charge it is an example of electrophile and therefore it can easily combine with the nucleophile let us see simple example okay this is our ethene molecule ch2 double bond ch2 when it comes with the contact with hcl addition of hcl takes place across the c double bond c in first step what happens hydrogen adds to carbon in first step when hydrogen adds to one carbon here this pi bond undergo breaking and hydrogen adds to carbon and second carbon acquires positive charge we get the carbocation intermediate now this carbocation further combined with cl minus it further combined with nucleophile and here we get you charge on the cl means electron pair this electron pair now form a bond with positively charged carbon and there is combination of carbocation with nucleophile and we get corresponding ethyl chloride we will see one more example uh, this is tertiary butyl bromide simple example alkaline hydrolysis of tertiary butyl bromide to me tala sn1 reaction asa matlela ahe tertiary butyl bromide on reaction with aqueous koh or naoh we get corresponding tertiary butyl alcohol this is substitution reaction this is a nucleophilic substitution and this is unimolecular nucleophilic substitution means in first step bond between carbon and bromine undergo breaking electron pair goes towards bromine it acquire negative charge there is a loss of br minus while carbon acquires positive charge we get the intermediate and this is nothing but the carbocation while in next step nucleophile suppose there is a water molecule it attack on the central carbon it attack on the central carbon and there is a formation of bond between carbon and oxygen okay mag itha jo oh2 kiwa h2 molecule ahe ya oxygen acquire acquire positive charge now there is a just loss of hydrogen tyamadun ek hydrogen bahar padto this bond undergo breaking this bonded electron pair goes towards oxygen and there is a loss of h my h plus and we get the corresponding tertiary butyl alcohol just there is a combination of that nucleophile with carbocation and we get corresponding tertiary butyl alcohol this is unimolecular nucleophilic substitution uh, as in one reaction okay tanantar to purcha hai elimination of proton again tertiary butyl bromide cbr bonds uh, break heterolytically bromine that electron pair goes towards bromine it acquire negative charge carbon acquires positive charge in that case suppose alpha hydrogen atom that bond between carbon and alpha hydrogen atom undergo breaking then that electron pair that electron pair goes towards electron deficient carbon we have studied in the case of hyper conjugation then there is a loss of h plus ion ethyl h plus ion bar padto and we get the corresponding alkene and this is just elimination of proton means if there is a some specific type of reagent if we have used it then again there is a loss of h plus ion uh, from the uh, alpha carbon and we get the corresponding alkene thus carbocations can be converted into alkene due to loss of proton due to elimination of proton okay this is again example regarding the reactivity okay this is isobutylene actually that alkene is nothing but the isobutylene okay now let us see one more addition to the unsaturated compound consider example of uh, alkene cs3 c again cs3 double bond cs2 this is isobutylene when that isobutylene comes in contact with any carbocation here this is unsaturated compound and comes in contact with electrophile now that carbocation that is electrophile it can adds to that double bond it can adds to that carb c double bond c when the itla pi bond break hoto and there is a formation of new bond between terminal carbon and that positively charged carbon manje itla pi bond break hoto ani ya don carbon cha madhe namin bond cha formation hoto and we get the new 
we get the new species. Now here that carbon having positive charge. Current ha pi bond break hot as pana. Electron pair goes away from this carbon. Hence it acquire positive charge. And we get the again tertiary carbocation. And this is just a uh, addition to the unsaturated compound. Means that carbocation can be added to the C double bond C, or it may be added to the in some cases C triple bond C, and we get the corresponding intermediate. Okay, let us see uh, interesting example of uh, rearrangement reaction, molecular rearrangement. This is example of primary carbocation CS three, CS two. Again, there is a CS two and that. Terminal carbon having positive charge. Okay, this is the primary carbocation. Suppose the bond between that carbon and hydrogen undergo breaking now this electron pair may be form a new bond ya thikani karan ya thikani carbon it having positive charge it is electron deficient tamula alpha bond jo ahe ch jo bond ahe to break hoto hai and that electron pair goes towards electron deficient carbon primary carbocation well this one is the secondary carbocation we know that secondary is more stable therefore primary carbocation can be easily convert into secondary due to specific rearrangement yeah rearrangement bola kaise convert ho sakta let us see same type of reaction here also this is example of primary carbocation here this methyl group can be shifted towards that positively charged carbon this methyl group can be shifted towards electron deficient carbon but methyl group ikade gela tar ha jo carbon ahe now this carbon acquires positive charge tyavar ti positive charge deto hai आणि आपल्याला या ठिकाणी मिळतोय हिअर देर इज अ पॉझिटिव्ह चार्ज ऑन दॅट सेंट्रल कार्बन म्हणजे कुठलाही मी ऍक्च्युली इथं वर दाखवलेला आहे डझन मॅटर कोणताही दाखवू शकतो दोन्ही पैकी आपण ओके सपोज या मिथिल ग्रुपचं शिफ्टिंग मी इथं दाखवलंय हेन्स दॅट कार्बन ऍक्वायर्स पॉझिटिव्ह चार्ज अँड वी गेट द मोस्ट स्टेबल कार्बोकॅटायन दिस इज वन टू शिफ्ट ऑफ मिथिल ग्रुप अँड वी गेट द स्टेबल कार्बोकॅटायन consider one more example suppose here also this is secondary carbocation and here also uh, in secondary carbocation methyl group can be migrate towards that central uh, positively charged carbon itla methyl group to migration ho shakta tyamule ata ya carbon varti positive charge jail and we get again tertiary carbocation which is more stable than previous one and thus due to the stability uh, that's primary carbocation can be convert into secondary or tertiary while secondary can be convert into tertiary carbocation this is actually examples of rearrangement reaction okay uh, let us last one a very interesting example may okay this is primary amine having uh, a uh, three membered cycle actually this is the three membered cycle and then ch2 and nh2 primary amine on a reaction with nano2 and hcl yes we are using nano2 hcl means definitely that nh2 group should be uh, undergo diazotization this is diazotization reaction always carried out at low temperature near about 0 to 5 degrees celsius temperature what happens that nh2 group undergo diazotization and we get corresponding diazonium ion this is a very common reaction now this diazonium ion may be undergo decomposition here this bond undergo breaking and here there is a loss of n2 means nitrogen gas at un bahar padto hai while that carbon acquires positive charge this carbon acquire positive charge and we get the carbocation but now this carbocation further undergo rearrangement this is also example of wagner mirvin rearrangement मग इथं या ठिकाणी कशा पद्धतीनं रिअरेंजमेंट होते बघा हिअर दिस सायकल अंडर गो ब्रेकिंग या ठिकाणी हा जे थ्री मेंबर्ड सायकल आहे याचं ब्रेकिंग होतं म्हणजे हा बॉन्ड ब्रेक होतो देर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ न्यू बॉन्ड बिटवीन दिस कार्बन बाय अँड डिस कार्बन या दोन कार्बनच्या मध्ये नवीन बॉन्ड तयार होतो अँड हिअर दिस कार्बन आय विल मेक स्टार टू दिस कार्बन नाव इट अक्वायर पॉझिटिव्ह चार्ज इथं पॉझिटिव्ह चार्ज येतोय अँड वी गेट द intermediate here this carbon having actually now there is the formation of four member cycle and one carbon having positive charge okay while that positively charged uh, carbon actually combine with the nucleophile nucleophile ta tyavar ta attack hoto hai and we get the cyclobutanol oh group ta attack hoto hai and we get the cyclobutanol and thus in this reaction we get unexpected product because there is a rearrangement of intermediate carbocation and generally that intermediate carbocation can be easily undergo rearrangement due to the stability order and we get the unexpected cyclobutanol this is again example of the wagner mirvin rearrangement okay this is just about the first reaction intermediate we have studied a uh, uh, detailed discussion of that carbocation uh, actually carbocation is the positively charged carbon species so we have studied introduction then also about the structure then the generation then the stability and lastly about the reactivity of that carbocation intermediate okay this is about the first one to one